we're going to take a look at this new talk pod, um, the N58 Plus, today. This device was introduced back in November, uh, or it was available to the public in late November. But TalkPod has done very little to promote this or even explain what it is. Um, so I finally got my hands on one. We actually have a total of four devices running the virtual amateur app, period. Uh, none of these in the back. These are just, those are just some other radios here. But this TalkPod, uh, TalkPod developed a piece of software called Virtual Amateur App. And it runs on their Link Poon platform. So let's turn this on. We'll show you a little bit about what makes this thing different. Um, anyone that already has a TalkPod IP radio or network radio, this will do everything those do, right? It'll run Zello, um, it'll run Echolink, TeamSpeak, Plummel. Plummel is very similar to TeamSpeak. Uh, the ZMR group runs a Plummel server. But anyway, anything you can run on a smartphone or IP radio or network radio will run on these talk pods because that's what they are. They're Android-based IP radios, which are basically cell phones uh, disguised to look like radios. Okay, when this thing turns on, it powers up the virtual amateur app. I apologize for the quality of this video. I'm doing this with my phone. My group. I promise I will do a much better quality video um, in the very near future. This is just the first one in a whole series of videos to come. So it powers up. It comes on to the virtual frequency that you were last on. And just like a dual band uh, HT, you, know, you could have the second, second frequency down here in the other VFO. Let me change A to B to... I think I did that wrong. So now we're on the A VFO. Wow, the qual the clarity is really bad. Like I said, I apologize for the quality. We'll have some better videos here really soon. So it's on the virtual 146.520 frequency. Remember, there's no RF in here. This is all just running a piece of software that connects through the internet. And anybody else with one of these talk pods... Um, on the same virtual frequency, we'll hear you. So it's similar to Zello, but yet it's entirely different. I know that doesn't make sense yet, but we'll go into it in more depth on uh, future videos. So I'm going to just key this up, see if uh, if anybody's out there. N9KGC, listening. Just like on the real RF, it's hard to get anybody to come back to us here. N9KGC, listening. On uh, 146.520. Hmm. All right, for the next video, I'll make sure somebody is on. We have four of these now. Uh, I have two myself. Uh, Stu, WA2JNF, has one running. And Ralph, N8YQJ. Uh, we're all part of the ZMR group, or ZMR group. Um, you can check out the website at zmr.us. Uh, we have a Facebook page with a huge presence. And that website has information about the group. Mostly licensed hams. But licensed hams that also embrace uh, VOIP and ROIP platforms in addition to traditional RF. All right, well, this, like I say, this is just a very brief intro video. This device is amazing. I'm more than satisfied with it. Um, and there'll be definitely more videos to come showing in depth how to get this set up and working, period. Because out of the box, it's a little, it's a little convoluted. It's a little cloudy as far as when you first turn it on, what you got to do. Uh, but once it's set up, it works really, really well. All right, thanks for watching. Any questions? Be sure to post them here. I'll look at all the comments, and we will reply. Also, check out the Facebook group. I'll put a uh, link to that and the website in the description. Uh, thanks again. 73s, and thanks for watching.